the Mexican accent, the Z and the S sound. By looking at this sound in particular, you're going to be able to break down a good Mexican accent in no time at all. Let's get started. In American English, we have two sounds. We have the voiced and the unvoiced S or Z sound. So we'll say uh, so. Notice that. So. Or at the end of a word, this. This. As additionally, we have the z sound, the voiced z sound. So if we were to say zoo or nose, nose, his nose grows. Now, notice, when I say that nose grows, those are both spelled with an S. So American English, you know, really, it's, that's why it's so challenging for people to learn the American accent, because it's always changing depending upon the word itself. But for this, we're going to start to de-voice, take away the Z sound for that either letter S or letter Z. In other words, when we have the sound Z in American English, we're going to make it more of an S sound and make it very easy. So we'll try this. We're going to say his nose grows because he's always telling lies. And notice there are lots of Z's in there. If you say it fast, you might not notice his nose grows because he's always telling lies. But those are voiced Z sounds. Let's devoice them. His nose gross. His nose gross. So you notice suddenly we have this s sound. His nose gross. His nose gross because he's always telling lies. His nose gross because he's always telling lies. Try that. His nose gross. His nose gross because he's always telling lies. Because he's always telling lies. Look how easy that is. All you have to do is take that z sound and make it into an s sound. Now, for you native Spanish speakers out there, this is a great way of breaking down how to do the American accent by working in reverse and noticing that there are some words such as is or easy that oftentimes you'll say as is or easy. And once you realize you need to add a little bit of a z sound to it, You'll be speaking the American accent. So it works both ways. Very easy. We'll try it one last, one last time. There's a British accent for you. We'll try it one last time, and that is, he's, he snows gross because he's always telling lies. He snows gross because he's always telling lies. Try that. You'll be on your way to an authentic Mexican accent in no time.